Well, I hope you let me I need know. A beep. You have to participate. Oh, I sure. To... Ready? Yes. Okay. Beep. CJ, Claude Diamond, I'm sorry it took me so long to get back to you. Listen, I spoke to the attorney. I've got the paperwork in front of me, but I need to speak with you by 2.30 today, 421-412. And how's the family? Are they still eating turkey sandwiches? Listen, I need to talk with you. Give me a call so I can get this thing, uh, take care of this whole thing. 421-412 and take care. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Attorney? <laughs> I know. I'm like, Attorney? Uh, you're sure. you're going to get that phone call and what's going to, you don't know who the hell I am or anything, but you're going to get that. What's the emotion I just raised in you? Who the hell is Alert? The yeah. Right. Panic. Exactly. <laughs> Panic. The fact that you knew my name, right? Okay. Mate, yeah. I've, you know, and I might not know your name. I can do it without your name too, but let's assume that your voicemail, a lot of people give their voice, their name and their voicemail or something like that. But you got that, you got that crazy Claude video, uh, uh, voicemail just now. What's going through your mind when you heard that? I've got the paperwork ready. I spoke to the attorney, everything. I need to talk to you. It's urgent it's by 2.30. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Why did I do all that? What's the point of all that? In a sense of What's urgency, right? Uncertainty, what, what is it about, right? Sure. Legal matters are always, people are very cautious when it comes to legal matters. Sure. Could be an offer on a product. You don't know. What happens when we don't know? Does curiosity kill us? Drives me crazy. <laughs> Absolutely. Quick story. Absolutely. Another, another story. We live six months in uh, Colorado, six months in California. Okay. We come back here. We go to the Safeway. It's our big super. I'm in a little town here, but we have a Safeway. And I'll go there and I'll go down the aisle and someone will go, Claude Diamond, how are you? How's the family? How's Claudia? How are the kids and everything? I don't know who the hell they are. <laughs> Is, am I the only one? Okay. So what do we do when we get somebody who knows us and, and we, we're totally lost? What do we, what's our normal reaction? Go along. Oh, with it. oh, everybody's fine. Thank you for asking. How's your family and everything? And I'll just go along and then I'll run down the next aisle to Claudia, my wife. And I'll say, honey, who the hell are those people? Because she has a better memory than me. And she'll say, oh, we had dinner with them. Don't you remember? Oh, okay. Okay. Why wouldn't I, why wouldn't I tell, why wouldn't I go to these people? Who are you? Why didn't I do that? <laughs> so you go to your wife too to help you out. Oh, I got who are they? <laughs> oh yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, absolutely. The thing about it is I didn't want to embarrass myself. If we get on the phone and we act familiar, oh, sorry, it took me so long to get back to you. See, I never lie, but I'm very creative. <laughs> Okay. I, sorry, it took me so, CJ, sorry, it took me so long to get back to you. I got the paperwork here in front of me. Need to speak with you. I ran it past my attorney and everything. Boom. And hopefully you'll call me back out of curiosity. And then I have to fix it, don't I? So call me back, CJ. One more role play. Sure. You don't know who the hell I am, but you got that message. Sure. Uh, ring, hello. ring. Hello, this is Claude Diamond Consulting Group. How may I help you? I got a call from somebody in your office today about some paperwork. Wait, what do you think? Oh, what was uh, in your name? CJ. Hi, CJ. I'm Claude. How can I help you today? What was the message about? Something about paperwork, having an attorney review it. You're going to get back to me by 2.30. What is this about? I don't know. Uh, you know, my, I don't know. <laughs> this, this isn't about real estate, is it? I don't know. You tell me. You're the one that called me. You're right. You get a cookie. Um, see, you don't have a house for sale or you're buying something. You don't want an investment with an 18% return, do you? Why are we talking? Help me out, please. I'm lost. I'm so embarrassed. Well, you should be. You tell me why you called you're me. Right. You're you know, right. I get a lot of calls these days. I do have yeah, a property on the market. Aren't they annoying as hell and everything like that? But you said I love your message. I must have, I leave so many messages. I'm sorry. My memory's gone. And everything does this you have something for sale or for rent or anything I real do. estate? Oh, that's and it's and it's is it for sale it's for sale but you sold it already i'm sure of it no i have not it's you still on the market would you like to sell it today sure you mind if i ask you a few questions you ask me a few and i'll make you an offer and you can tell me to get lost or maybe we can do business today that sounds fine thank you boom i'm in the door yeah. I'm, all I want to do is talk to a few people every day. We think we have to make hundreds of phone calls and mail all these postcards and do all this busy. We just need to have a few quality phone calls every day and magic happens. And even